Okay, I'm going to introduce you to the Layers panel. You will see over on the right side of my project uh, a panel called Layers. It's free-floating. If I grab the black bar at the top, I can drag it around and reposition it in a different place. I can also grab this lower right corner and make it smaller and wider, or I can, you know, I can resize it so it fits better into my workspace. Now, the Layers panel has a... Um, shows all the different pieces of my project. Layer 1 is the white background, the second layer is the blue circle, the third layer is the red square, and the fourth layer is these words right here, this is text. Now by default, each layer is layered with a number, so layer 1, for example, is the first one. Um, I can rename a layer by double-clicking on the layer name and just typing the new, uh, the new name in that box. So I'm going to call layer 1 white background, and I'm going to change red square to red rectangle because that's a little bit more accurate okay and now you can see each layer is more accurately named except for I've misspelled rectangle all right now I can toggle the visibility of the layer off or on by clicking the eyeball to the left of the layer thumbnail so for example if I want to see what the project looks like without that rectangle I just click the eyeball to hide it or click the eyeball again to turn it back on I can also change how transparent the layer is. You can see at the bottom of my project, the red rectangle is fairly faded. I can see a lot of white through it. So what I can do is come up, is select that layer, come up to the top of the screen, open the opacity slider, drag it to the right to make the layer more opaque and darker, and drag it to the left to make the layer more transparent and lighter. And that comes in handy when I'm trying to layer things on top of each other and I want to be able to partially see through certain things. And we'll see that a little bit more later on. Alright, so quick review. To make the layers visible or invisible, toggle the eyeball. To rename the layer, double click the layer name and simply type over the old name. And to change the transparency of the layer, select the layer and then drag the opacity slider left to make it lighter, right to make it darker. And that's your layers palette.